For version 3.2 of the Getting Things Done Outlook add-in, we've added three new features to the project detail form. The first new feature allows the user to save email folder selections per project on the project detail form. If you open a project detail form for a project and click the Mail tab, you can see the number of folders selected for this particular project. If you click the Select Folder button and add more folders to search, the number of folders selected will change. To save the folder selection, select Manage Save or simply click the X to close the form. The folder selections will automatically save if you close the form without saving first. Now if you open a different project, we will see a different number of folders selected instead of the six from the previous project. Older versions of the add-in just remember your last email folder selections and display them for your next open project. Not anymore! Now you can save email folder selections on a per project basis. The second exciting new feature allows subfolders to be automatically selected when selecting mail folders. Before, users often had to select the top folder as well as each subfolder located under the top folder. Tedious! Not anymore! Once you select the top folder, the subfolders will automatically be selected too. The last new feature allows hyperlinks to be added to the Notes tab in the Project Detail form. Hot diggity! Previous versions only allowed a plain text to be entered. Now you can simply copy the web page's address from your browser or type the address in the Notes tab. Click Manage Save to save the changes or simply click the X to close the Project Detail form. If you made any changes, click Yes to save changes in this project. And that, in a nutshell, are the new features for the Project Detail form.